Hey guys, let us know with Crypto Marie Loco and International. Diddy's former bodyguard says he saw the rapper get physical with Cassie in Cam Potter. He has a God syndrome. Let me tell you guys something. Now, a lot of people are going to take advantage of what's going on to this fool, PDD, Sean Com, whatever the hell his name is, to come out and say what they saw. Why didn't you come out being, stop being a P word and say what you saw before this thing exploded? Something could have been done. You never said crap because you were in the paywall. You were making money. Now you're going to come out. You saw this. You saw that. Give me a break. The former head of security for Sean Diddy Combs told Pierce Morgan on Monday that he saw the music mogul get physical with former girlfriends Cassie and Kim Potter four or five times while working for him. Why didn't you say something then, you fool? Bodyguard Roger Barnes said that he didn't think much of the apology video that Didi, aka Sean Combs, shared after the disturbing hotel footage from 2016 of him assaulting Cassie was released by CNN. Oh, come on. You need a little piece of fame by coming out now. Why didn't you say something in 2016? It's been eight years, you fool. In an Instagram video, Combs admitted i was effed up i mean hit rock bottom he also said I, I i take full responsibility for my action and that video disgusting i was disgusted then when i did it i am disgusted now i went out and sought professional help yeah 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 whatever i got into going to therapy had to go into rehab oh really I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I am so sorry. That I will put it on you. You better ask God for mercy and grace. Because it's the only one we would not be able to witness when you are going to hell. Bun said he's up to the same games. He never mentioned Cassie's name and that apology. So to me, he didn't humble himself enough. I think he said what people wanted to hear, not what he felt. Not what he felt. I thought about it, really, but then I did a little research where I realized because of the NDA they had signed when he gave Cassie the money when Cassie sued him, none of them could have mentioned each other's name in the press. That's why he didn't mention her name and his lawyers had to review what